Lachey, I, I don't know what to say. Am I fired? Well, hell no, you ain't fired. But all those people that was laughing, they can't come back. And, and I'm sorry, but your father? Well, he's banned. Forever. I totally understand. So I'll see you tomorrow. You get some rest now. You kinda had a hard day. I cannot believe you, Dad. Why would you get drunk and show up at my job for amateur comedy night? You've never told a joke in your life. Your fundamentalist ass doesn't have a sense of humor. You only have a sense of superiority. God, I hate having to even go in here and see him. Smell him! Ugh! Dad! Dad! You hear? What the? Look at this mess! How did we get here, Dad? Ten years? Ten years of sobriety down the drain in one night? Because of me? What the? Damn it! He leaves the fridge wide open. God, all the food's probably going. Jeez, Pops. You really put on a show tonight, didn't you? Because I finally stood up for my own autonomous sovereignty? You're not going to pin this shit on me. I'm tired of your dictatorial scapegoating and gaslighting. Maybe it's time I move out. Stop enabling your narcissistic control efforts. Stop being afraid to truly live and have life more abundantly. Hello? Hello? Is this Hannah? This is Dr. Mark Thompson. I'm a professor at your university and also a recruiter with the FBI. I understand you're majoring in forensic criminal psychology with a focus on psychopathy. Yes, that's correct. I didn't expect a call like this. What can I do for you, Dr. Thompson? Well, your recent paper on behavioral patterns in psychopathy caught my attention. I wanted to discuss some opportunities that could align with your interests. We're looking for talented students like yourself who might consider a career with the FBI, particularly in areas that require expertise in criminal psychology. Wow, I'm honored, but I have to ask, how did you find out about me? Let's just say, I keep an eye out for promising talent. Your work stood out, not only academically, but also because of your unique perspective. We should meet to discuss what the FBI could offer someone with your skill. I'd love that, Dr. Thompson. I'm very interested in learning more. Great. And by the way, I hear you had quite the night at the comedy club recently. It seems you have a knack for handling unexpected situations, an essential skill in our line of work. You could say that. I learned to think on my feet early in life, and sometimes no response is better than any response at all. Exactly the kind of cool head we need around here. I'll send you the details for our meeting. Looking forward to it, Hannah. Thank you, Dr. Thompson. I'm looking forward to it, too. Yes, sir! It's always the same, isn't it? The world's gone mad, and this, this is where it leads. A place like this, a crime like this. Sin begets sin, after all. It's brutal, Irma. No sign of a struggle, though. Almost like he knew it was coming. Or maybe he trusted whoever did this. We've seen this before, haven't we? Yes, but that doesn't make it any easier. These men, living like this, in darkness, away from the light. It's no wonder they end up like this. They stray from the path, and this is where it leads them. You think this was personal? Someone sending a message? This place isn't exactly known for friendly encounters. Could be, or it could just be the demons we let into this world, feeding off the darkness. Either way, it's our job to bring the truth into the light. The world may be lost, but we have to keep fighting, no matter how hopeless it seems. Yeah, we have to. But sometimes, sometimes, sometimes I wonder if we're just putting band-aids on a wound that'll never heal. Now don't get it twisted, detective. 
We're not here to heal the world, just to bring justice where we can. God's judgment will come in time. For now, we focus on what's in front of us, this man, this crime, and the truth that needs to be uncovered. 57 stab wounds, his rear end in the air, with a galvanized steel pipe shoved so far up, we can barely see the tip of it. Don't forget the one down the throat. Good evening. We interrupt this program to bring you a breaking news update. Authorities have just discovered the body of an unidentified male in a local park, a location known for its secluded and controversial activity. The victim was found earlier this evening in a remote area of the park, where it's believed he was targeted in what appears to be a brutal and deliberate act of violence. Details are still emerging, but we can confirm that the scene is currently under investigation by local law enforcement. We now go live to our correspondent, Dallas Corbin, who has just arrived on the scene. Dallas, what can you tell us? Thank you, Lana. I'm here at the scene where investigators are working tirelessly to piece together what happened. The victim, a male whose identity has not yet been released, was discovered by a passerby earlier this evening. Police are treating this as a potential homicide, given the circumstances and the location in which the body was found. For now, details remain scarce, but sources indicate that this part of the park is known for being frequented by members of the LGBTQ community which has raised concerns about the nature of the crime. Detective Irma Patterson, a well-known figure in the department, is leading the investigation, and we're expecting an official statement from her and other authorities shortly. We'll continue to monitor the situation and provide updates as more information becomes available. Dad, Dad, you hear? You know, they always say steel is strong, unyielding, but they don't know it like I do. They don't feel its power, its persuasion. Ha! Huh. People think they're so solid, so unbreakable, until they meet me. I just have to apply a little pressure, just the right amount, and snap. They crumble like rust under my touch, but oh, the music they make, the screams, like a symphony. A twisted melody that only I can and conduct. We're expecting an official statement from her and other authorities shortly. We'll continue to stay tuned for the next exciting episode of Our Father's More Information.